Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel, where I'll be guiding you through the process of changing the slug for a custom post type. I've already gone through the steps of creating a custom post type, which I've named Events by using ACPT, and I have populated this custom post type with various posts to provide content for our website. When you select any of the posts from the Events type, you'll notice that the URL in your browser's address bar reflects the structure of our website's link followed by the post name slug, and finally, the title of the post. Currently, this slug defaults to events, which can be seen clearly when you visit our custom post archive page as well. But what if we want to change this slug to something more specific or relevant to our site's content or branding? We can do so by going to the dashboard. From there, access the ACPT and select custom post types. There will be a list of both native and custom post types that have been registered. Find the events post type in the list and click on edit. This will take you to the settings page for your custom post type, which includes all the initial details you provided when creating it. Navigate through the first and second tabs of the settings by clicking next step, as we won't be making changes there. Head straight to the other settings tab. Scroll down within this tab to find the custom rewrite rules section. Here you can enter the new slug for your post type. In our example, we'll change it to Custom Events. Feel free to input any slug that suits your needs. Once you've entered the new slug, click on the Save button and be patient as the page reloads to apply the changes. Now that we have updated the slug in the ACPT settings, there's one more critical step to ensure that your changes take full effect. It's essential to resave the permalink structure to avoid any errors or broken links. To do this, navigate to the settings on your WordPress dashboard. Within settings, you'll find permalinks. Click on that. Once you're in the permalinks section, you don't need to make any changes. Simply click the Save Changes button. This will refresh your website's permalink structure and apply the new slug you've set for your custom post type. Now, let's verify the changes. Head over to the home page of your website and click on one of the posts under the events type. Check the URL. You should see the updated slug, in this case, custom events, confirming that your new slug is in use. Additionally, visit your archive page to ensure that the slug has been changed there as well. That wraps up our tutorial. Thank you for following along and be sure to check out more of our content.